Hello, I'm Pastor Bob Miller, lead pastor here at Plymouth First United Methodist Church. And welcome once again to this online worship experience, this being on the traditionally observed day of Pentecost. You know, speaking of tradition, this year has not been a traditional year at all. But if you've been keeping up on the news, you know that the mandated efforts around mitigating the spread of the COVID virus have made recognizable progress. And as a result, those efforts are beginning to be progressively relaxed. This is increasing access to retail businesses and is allowing for small social groups to congregate. It also means that the day is coming when churches will be able to open our doors once again for in-person worship and faith formation. Plymouth First Church included. And while that exact date is yet to be set, the primary driver for opening back up will be the church's readiness to ensure people's safety and security, of course, following the direction and guidelines of the various credible authorities. And you can bet we here at Plymouth First Church are working aggressively to put in place all the policies and procedures along with the facilities and resources to make that happen. And you can also bet that we will still continue our online access right alongside our in-person access. And that is because digital access will continue to be an important conduit for sharing the visible presence of Jesus Christ that more and more people may personally know of Christ's love and guidance and grace in their lives. And as such, we are working to continue both online and in-person opportunities for growing in, in prayer, for knowledge and application of biblical scriptures, for engaging in mission work, and for the spiritual discipline of providing resources to the ministries of Christ's church. And relative to that discipline, many of you are mailing in your offerings via paper check. For others, it's more convenient to make use of one of our electronic giving options, either setting up regular giving from your bank account or credit card through our pfumc.org website, or texting an offering to our text to give number, or downloading the Give Plus Church app on your smartphone. But whichever option you're using, please accept our heartfelt thank you to you all who are keeping our church ministries active and vibrant through your faithful giving. And so, let us begin worship, doing so with a prayer. O oh God of love and grace, we gather for worship this day in praise of your name. On this day of Pentecost, we especially remember how you sent your Holy Spirit into our midst, filling us with the promise of new life. We are empowered by the light that Christ shines upon us, casting his spotlight upon the shadows and the dark corners that seek to subdue us. Make this time of worship powerfully transforming for us. Help us to hear and discern your voice from among all the others. Guide us to embrace and live out that which you will teach us. And make us to be reflections of who you are and what your grace and power and wisdom and love means for each of us and all of humanity. We pray this in the name of Jesus, the complete reflection of all that you are. Amen. And now, I invite you to keep this playlist running so that you can see Pastor Susie Hutchinson's message showing us how our new normal may be a lot like how Christ's church got started so long ago. It's followed by this week's episode of Kids Kingdom with Eden and Sarah. And of course, you'll want to stay connected for the powerful and inspirational music selections that continue. May God's blessing be with you all.